Yo, my name is Benjamin and this is the linking update in Framer. We have redesigned our linking UI to support many more properties like rel, parameters and tracking. The new parameters property allows us to keep the existing URL parameters when clicking external links that might also have URL parameters. Here's an example. Our demo site has a UTM campaign parameter. And when we now click our external link, we get its parameters plus the source URL parameters. In our case, the UTM campaign. Great for tracking external links. Next, let's talk about rel. Rel attributes define the relationship between the current page and a linked page. They help with SEO, protect user privacy, and give search engines context about a link's origin and purpose. Here's how they work in Framer. I'll select my button here, go to the link panel, and let's pretend this is a sponsored Amazon link. I'll simply add the rel attribute set to sponsored, and that's all there is to it. We can also add multiple rel attributes to a single link. If this were a link to a comment thread, for example, we could set rel to both UGC and nofollow. This tells the browser we're linking to user-generated content, and it tells Google not to associate our site with the linked page. And all of these new properties have been added to the CMS as well, making linking in Framer more powerful across the board. And that's pretty much it for this video. We hope you enjoy these new linking updates. And as always, stay tuned for more updates coming soon.